What's up guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix pardon the interruption in Microsoft Store on Windows. So if you're having problems with your Microsoft Store on Windows and you're getting that pop-up or that issue, well, in this case, there is a few things that you can try doing here. Now, typically speaking, if you do get that error or something like this, typically speaking, you have the option here that says update now, which in this case, you wanna go and click on the update now button here and basically update Microsoft Store. Now, sometimes you may not or you don't have the latest updates. That's why you're having this issue. But in some cases, this might not work. So what are the other things that you could try doing? So the first other thing that you could try doing here is you may want to initiate the update or Windows update here uh, via your window or via your windows here. So at the bottom left, you want to go and just type in update, open up check for updates. And from here, you want to go and just click on check for updates here and just wait for the download or the update to complete. Now, to be speaking, you need to restart your PC after the update is complete and see if that actually helps. Now, if that doesn't all solve your issue, there is one more thing that you could try. Now, you want to go to search here and just type in services and just open up services here. Now, what we need to do is you want to go and just click on the name or any name here that you see and just press W on your keyboard. Now you want to look for the option here that says Windows Update. You want to right click on it and you want to go and click on Properties. Now from here you want to cho change the starter type here to either Automatic or Automatic Delayed Start. Now once you change that, click on Apply and OK at the bottom right here. And basically once you update it, you want to go and just start your PC and from then on it should automatically download the files or the update needed to solve this issue. But in this case that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like or maybe subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.